Hello food lovers, welcome back to my kitchen. Today we will be diving into the world of flavors and colors with this spicy fried chicken. It is coated in a flavorful spice and deep fried to perfection. And so guys, wear your apron and let's get started. To begin, in a clean bowl, we're going to add a half teaspoon of ginger, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of chicken bouillon, powder, half a teaspoon of paprika, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, half a teaspoon of hot pepper. And going to put two spoons of vegetable oil and give that a very good mix. Put them all together and here I have some chicken breast which I'm going to marinate in this and I'll leave it for 30 minutes to marinate while I start the other preparations. I want to thank all my subscribers. Thank you so much for your love and support and comments. And for the new subscribers, you are welcome to this kitchen. All the ingredients for this recipe will be in the description box. Please check it out. In a flat bowl, we're going to add a hundred gram of flour. 50 gram of corn flour, 1/2 a teaspoon of garlic powder, 1/2 a teaspoon of paprika, 1/2 a teaspoon of hot pepper, and 1/2 a teaspoon of ginger. and a teaspoon of baking powder and a teaspoon of chicken bouillon a teaspoon of turmeric powder and we're going to give this a very good mix put them all together In another clean bowl, remove from the already spiced flour three tablespoons of already spiced flour and put in the bowl. To this, we're going to add one fresh egg. Also, we're going to add some little water to this. And now we're going to give all a very good mix. Let this mix be, let it not be too thick and let it not be too watery. Let it just be between the borderline. If need be, you can add some little water to this and the consistency should look like this. After the chicken has been marinating for 30 minutes, we are now going to dip it into the flour mix. Give it a very good dip in the mix. And then put it in the dry flour mix. Mix that into 
make sure that the flour touches every part of this chicken. In a heated oil pan, we are going to add the chicken breast. And this we are going to fry for 7 to 8 minutes until they become golden brown. And turn to the other side and fry also until they are crispy on the outside and cooked and tender in the inside. As soon as the chicken has been fried and cooked for 7 to 8 minutes on both sides and it's golden brown, it's now time to serve. This can be eaten with jollof rice, with salad, with potato salad. It can be eaten alone with these fresh tomatoes as you can see there. This chicken was so delicious. It was crunchy and very very spicy. And guys, drop a comment how you see this video and if you're going to try this recipe please I would like to know how it turned out and also please smash the like button I beg you support me subscribe to my channel for more beautiful and easy simple recipes like this thank you guys